Hi, how are you guys doing today? I hope you're doing great. I'm doing great. We are headed to the Greenbrier Resort in White Sulphur Springs, West Virginia. We've been there a couple times. One time I'd eaten at Draper's, which is inside the hotel, and another time we were on the golf course at Sam Sneed's restaurant. But today I have every intention of going to the main dining room to have breakfast. I haven't done that since I'm a, I was a kid. Hope they're decorated for Christmas. I'll tell you a little bit more about the resort when we get there. So I hope you'll come along with me. Well, we're at the Greenbrier. It's a National Historic Landmark, world-class resort, and it's been welcoming guests since 1778. The Natural Mineral Springs drew their first guest over 250 years ago and continues to lure visitors to the 11,000-acre luxury retreat. The guest list includes 28 U.S. presidents, and it's long been a favored destination of royalty, celebrities, and business leaders such as Bob Hope, Bing Crosby, Sam Sneed, Prince Rainier, Prince Grace, Princess Grace, Judy Garland, Eddie Fisher and Debbie Reynolds actually had their honeymoon here. And when Todd, his, her son, found out about it, him and his wife, Catherine Hickland, had a picture taken in the same place on a bike just as they did when they were here. I'll try to find a picture of it. Also been here Liza Minnelli, Regis Philbin, Prince Edward, Eleanor Roosevelt, the Duke and Duchess of Windsor, John Kennedy, Jennifer Garner, Lou Gehrig, Jessica Simpson, Ben Affleck, Brooke Shields, Charles, ba Charles Barkley, Sorry for my, my mouth. It won't move because it's 32 degrees out here. It's freezing. Um, Jack Nicholson, Lee Trevino, Arnold, Arnold Palmer, Raquel Welch, Barbara Eden, Paul Harvey, Phil Silvers. That's just a few people. It includes 710 rooms, 33 suites, and 96 guest and estate houses. It has 10 lobbies, 40 meeting rooms, and a complete conference center, 20 restaurants, 55 indoor and outdoor activities, sports, and about 35 retail shops. It's a widely regarded as one of the finest luxury resorts in the world, and it's surrounded by the beautiful Allegheny Mountains. It is so pretty up here. It offers exclusive services and amenities, championship golf, boutiques, world-renowned mineral spa. There's actually four golf courses, and for decades, it's been the mainstay for the PGA Tour including the Ryder Cup and the PGA Championship. Now there's a bunker here. I don't know if y'all have heard of that. There is actually a bunker here. In the, night, uh, in the late 1950s, the government approached the Greenbrier with assistance in creating a secret emergency relocation center for Congress and the President in the aftermath of a nuclear holocaust. The classified underground facility was named Project Greek Isle, and for 30 years the bunker was kept, stocked, and supplied. The, is, the existence of the bunker was not acknowledged by the government until Ted Gupp of the Washington Post reported it in a story in 1992 exposing the bunker, and it had to immediately be de decommissioned. When he broke the story, he faced severe backlash, revealing a secret that had been closely guarded for decades, and people regarded his story as a security um, threat because it could still be used today. Now, you can take this tour. It's $47. The room, I looked the rooms up online. They're between four and 600 a night. The suites ran around 1,000 a night, and they're bungalows, little houses on the property. They're around 24 hundred a night now and let me say this too if you purchase any item whether it's food or anything there is a resort fee of $39 a, st a historic preservation fee of 9.75 percent and a West Virginia sales tax of six cents and a three percent occupancy tax so <laughs> just wanted you to be aware of that so we're gonna head on in I wanted to show you some of the beautiful Christmas decorations. So they are decorated for Christmas. This looks like the main dining room. I'll 
I'll show you the beautiful chandeliers. Okay, we're in the main dining room. It's just beautiful. I if I can get some of the chandeliers. It's pretty crowded. They have a buffet, but I didn't get the buffet. I think I'm just going to get pancakes. I just want to get some of the portraits on the wall. I don't know if y'all can see the menu. They've got things like the sports, but I'm just going to run down the menu and let y'all look at it. And I'm going to get the just plain pancakes. They do have the buffet. See if it's got a price. Just, I think it's forty dollars. Yeah. Okay, breakfast has arrived, and look, you get a real little bottle of genuine, I don't mean real, but genuine maple syrup. Also, just want to say that there are real roses on every table. So I'll let you know how it is. Got some bacon. I didn't order bacon, but I'm glad it's there. And some powdered sugar. Some fresh coffee. I will say the coffee is fair. It's not great, but it's fair. So I'll let you know how the rest of it is. Well, I'm going to say it was fair. Um, it was okay. The pancakes were all right. The bacon had a little odd taste. Um, tomorrow we're going to eat at Amy's Bakery downtown, which will probably be a third of the cost. I don't know what it'll be. I'll let you know because I told you all the fees that would be tacked on. I think you just come here really, you know, for the ambiance and to see it because it's such an historic place. I know we came here when I was a kid and the food was just excellent but you know how things go as time goes on but I'll let you know the price when he brings me the bill okay with all the charges it ended up being 32.72 for three pancakes and a cup of coffee and I do see all the fees on there yeah Now, I came into one of the restrooms. I just wanted to show you how beautiful they are and how fancy they are. Oh my gosh, that's one of Mae West's fans from a film, I'm No Angel. It was gifted by Carlton Varney in 1996. Wow, that is Mae West fan. I never thought I'd see that here, but I want to show you the restroom. There's someone in here, so I want to be kind of quiet. They actually have towels in the bathroom that you just throw away. Very fancy. Now this is a tapestry of the Duke and Duchess. Here's a the Duke and Duchess of Windsor. This is him and his, all his regalia. But this is them here. I don't know if you can see it, but this is when they were here. Let's just walk around a little bit. This says Prime West. Oh, it's a restaurant. I'll just come out. I, know, I don't know if it's open or not, but we'll just. This is going to be closed today. It's got like a basketball theme. Jerry West, I know he's from West Virginia. Jerry West Boulevard. He was a professional basketball player, but that's it's just kind of a sports themed restaurant. Pretty cool. 
You just never know what you're gonna find here. There's so much I've not seen. Now we're coming back into some of the lobbies. There's so many of them. I'm excited it's decorated for Christmas. Oh, look at these trees. Let's go down this hall. Look at the lamp. Look at the chandeliers. This looks like um, just private board rooms. Yeah, the crystal room. So you could actually rent these rooms. Look at that. Look at these beautiful trees. I hope it's warming up outside. Let's look to see what's down this hallway. Now these are all just convention rooms, but I gotta show you what this looks like in here. Isn't that amazing? Guess they're getting ready to have a party. This place is just vast. Now this is one of the main lobbies. The portrait of George Washington over here. We'll go on down to another level. All Christmas presents. Christmas display. Okay, this is a hall of gift shops, but I just want to show you how pretty it's decorated. Very exclusive shops. Kayla. <laughs> Got a baby dog boutique. Baby. Apparently they allow dogs in here. This is a children's emporium. <laughs> it's a coffee bar and gourmet shop. There is a line to get in the gourmet shop. <laughs> Now, there are walls and walls here of famous people that have stayed here. That's the Duke and Duch Duchess of Windsor. Of course, that's Bob Hope. I don't think you can. There you can. Bob Hope. Here's Phil Silvers. It's a fashion designer Pierre Balmain fashion show here in 1950. Oh, there's Bing Crosby and pro golfer Gary Nixon. And there's the Prince, and there's Prince Rainier and Grace and the two kids. And there's Billy Graham, Paul Harvey, Billy Oh, and this is the picture of it, uh, Debbie Reynolds and Eddie Fisher on their honeymoon in 55 out front. Here's the photograph of Eddie and Debbie and then Todd, her daughter, and Katherine Hick Hickman. I'll find a better picture online of that. Kennedy here, where we just saw those uh, lamps where we just came from here in 1958. Gehrig on a golf outing. Woodrow Wilson and his wife. Let's see. Some of these people are just um, famous politicians that you probably wouldn't know. There's Eleanor Roosevelt here. 
If I don't recognize him, I'm going to keep moving. Here's the Chrysler chairman, Walter P. Chrysler. Now look at this room. Is it beautiful? Look at the ceiling. A beautiful place to come for Christmas. Very historic. There's the hallways to some of the rooms. Just another parlor. You could just get away and sit and relax with nobody around. I don't know who that is. It doesn't say. Oh, yes, it does. <laughs> Princess Grace. Wow. It talks about their visit here. And here is their, uh, they were here in 1963. And this is their signatures. A wonderful hotel in a beautiful setting. Exceptional memories. Wow. Grace DeMonico and Prince Rainier, 1963. This is a painting of her. It says they paid a surprise visit. I wondered why it was so cold, the doors open. <laughs> Well, I hope you enjoyed this quick tour to the Greenbrier. It's always special, especially at the holidays. So we're gonna brave the cold walk back to the car. Well, I hope you enjoyed that trip to the Greenbrier and the pancakes. I'm trying to get all in that I can. You ought to come and visit. If not, stay here. At least stay in the area. You could come and just look at it. But it's a special place. A lot of history. So thanks for coming with me. I appreciate you watching. You guys have a blessed day. God loves you. Till I see you again. Bye.